another Toxic Cupcakes Meg Shadow here and today I wanted to share with you some really cool pieces that I found um, in kind of random places um, for alternative fashion. Now some of these you can get still and some of them you can't but you could probably find something similar. Um, so I'm going to kind of do a try on as well. And um, I also wanted to show you my really cool jack-o'-lantern shirt. Actually, it's a dress, um, and I'm not sure if I'm going to do an outfit of the day video in this or not, but, so you might have seen it already, um, but if not, it's really cute. Um, I got it from CN Direct, actually, last year, so hopefully they have this. Um, if not, I'm sure they have something similar, but I love this dress so much. Anyways, on to the haul. Now, this stuff I've gotten kind of sporadically through probably all of September and October, just kind of randomly. Um, so let's go ahead and start. Um, so the very first thing that I got is this vegan leather skater skirt. Um, and it wasn't that wrinkled when I bought it, but um, this is actually originally from Forever 21. And um, I got it at a thrift shop. Um, so it's really cute on and I'll show you guys that but it zips up in the back like I said it's vegan leather and um, so yeah I like it um, I like to wear it like a high-waisted skirt so you'll see that in the video um, another skirt that I got this is also vegan leather but this is a little more stiff this um, I thought was a really great find actually um, it's kind of like a pencil skirt uh, again it's high-waisted which I find works pretty well with my figure, um, but I don't have a lot of high-waisted things, so I thought it was really cool to find a couple pieces. Um, and this is from YA, which I had never heard of, um, but yeah. So I found these two pieces, one at Goodwill, and then this one I found at just kind of a local, it's not really a consignment shop, but it's like an upscale thrift store, whatever you wanna call it, so yeah. There we go. Um, so next I found a really pretty flowy, it's a tank top so it might not be great for the season but I find with fall I like to layer. And so it's really nice and flowy there at the bottom. Um, and I found this, this is from Naked Zebra. I found it at TJ Maxx though. Uh, so there we go. And I paid $12 on sale for it. Um, it was originally $14. So that's kind of cute. Um, and I really like lace anything. <laughs> and so this has the lace panel in the front. And I really, really love that. Okay, so next, this is a newer piece. And you guys should be able to find this. This is a plaid black and red plaid to be honest and that's why I got it um, it's a mini skirt and I just think it's really cute um, this is from H&M this is from H&M's divided line and honestly normally I wear like a two or a four a two if it's made a little big um, but generally my correct sizing is a four in just about anything. Um, this I had to go up to a six in, so just keep that in mind, I would try things on. Um, I don't know that I've had that problem with H&M before, but this particular thing, I guess just the way it's made, it has like no give at all. Another thing I got from H&M is this little beanie here. And I love the tag on this. I don't remember how much the skirt costs. And I don't, oh yeah, um, it was $24.99, so. And then this beanie was only $6, and this is very similar to a Hello Kitty one that I have, but I don't always want to have Hello Kitty um, brand clothes, so I don't know, I'm just weird, like, it doesn't match everything, it's not always my mood, even though I do have a Hello Kitty tattoo, but hey. Um, so I like this, um, like, black and white speckle look, I don't know, I just think it's really cute. And I've not always loved beanies, but um, this one, for some reason, I, I really like, so 
Mm. Yep. I like it. <laughs> okay, so now for the really fun thing. <laughs> this is a Jack Skellington piece from Hot Topic. They did a Jack Skellington or a Nightmare Before Christmas line, really. Um, so this is from that line and it's got lace-up sleeves and they kind of flare out there at the end. And um, I wore this in one of my videos, but you couldn't really see it. Um, it's got this ruffle at the bottom and I'll put a video of me wearing it so you can see it better. But it's got this really pretty lace-up back and kind of a short little bustle in the back there. And the collar even has some lace detail. Now my hair is so messed up from that beanie. <laughs> but yeah, the collar even has some lace detail on it, which is really cool. So I really enjoy that piece, but I don't see myself wearing it all the time. But I did get 20% off on it. It's originally $59.50, um, and I got 20% off, and I think it was free shipping as well. So, so in the same vein of that, um, I got this, and this is actually from Spirit Halloween. I was really impressed to see something this well made that's not a costume, but actually a piece that you're supposed to wear on a daily basis. Um, so it's really well made. This piece, this part is really soft. Um, and then it's got little cutouts with the fishnet on it. And this is so, like... Blowy. I can't wait to show you guys this on because it's super cute and normally normally I'm not the type of person that wears a lot of color but th since this is a kind of different take on Sally's dress I was all for this so that's really cool too yay <laughs> and then I got this shirt so some of you guys know that I have an obsession with Harley Quinn <laughs> and Tank Girl. So Tank Girl, I've done a photo shoot um, to kind of emulate Tank Girl. Um, I had a model who, I guess, kind of fit that persona to me um, and kind of did like a pinup Tank Girl before. I love Tank Girl. Um, and this is hella cool because it mixes Harley and Tank Girl as a mashup. I got this from Shirt Punch. And um, it says Nerd Black on it, so I guess Nerd Black owns Shirt Punch, which I didn't know before. Um, but yeah, hella cool, and it's actually kind of soft. So yeah, I was really happy about it. Um, I got this in a size small. I probably could have gotten it in an extra small because it does look like it's going to be a little long, maybe. Um, but we'll see. It, it's probably going to shrink a little anyway. So yay, I'm super excited about that. And it's red don't normally wear red shirts, um, but hey, it's Harley and Tank Girl. I had to. And I actually do like red, I just... Okay, so this is a pair of shoes that I got at a thrift shop. Um, they were $8, as you can see. And these... These are from Ann Taylor. And they look brand new, except the name is worn off on the inside. But they are super cute for like a business outfit, so I'm gonna wear these to work a lot. Um, but they kind of have like a military, military esque vibe to them. So I'm actually really excited about those because I've been needing some more work shoes. Okay, so now on to some really fun stuff, and that is accessories. Um, Oh, and those shoes I also got at that other place, which is called the Clothes Less Traveled, and they give you, like, this little thing where you can punch it and you get, um, 20% off. So, pretty cool. Um, okay, so for accessories, these accessories I also got at that place called Clothes Less Traveled. Um, so if you are in the Peachtree City area... Um, that is where that shop is, and they have a website called clotheslesstravel.org. Don't know if they list anything there, but maybe they do. Um, okay, so this I thought was really cute. It is missing one of the little things on the bottom, but I don't really care. Um, it's this cute little, like, westerny looking thing. 
um, I think it's like, um, I forget what you call these things, but it's a necklace, like a bow tie thing. I thought it was cute. Um, it was half off of six dollars, so you really can't beat that. Three bucks. And I love the detail on it, so yeah. And now I have this bag of jewelry, and I could not resist. And you're gonna think this is craziness. I got this pair of earrings, and they were on a little earring card. These have not been worn, she told me. Um, apparently somebody who works there, um, or somebody makes them and sells them to the shop, I guess. But yeah, they're little trolls with pumpkins. How freaking adorable is that? <laughs> I love them. I don't know if I'll ever wear them, that's the sad part, but I just, I could not not get these. Pretty cool. And um, I can't remember how much those were. I want to say they were like a dollar. Um, I got this amber bracelet. Uh, hopefully it focuses. There we go. Maybe. Um, so I got this amber bracelet and I just thought it was really, really pretty. I don't know why I like amber quite a bit. I like amber jewelry quite a bit. Um, and this does look like it's natural, real amber. Um, so that's pretty cool. And I got that for $2.75. And this is another thing that was half off. So it was half off of three. Um, this is silver pearls with sparkly things. I don't know if this is picking up or not. Um, I don't know if we autofocus or not, but yeah, that's that. And I got this really for work, but I kind of like it because um, it's like a gunmetal gun metal silver and not just like regular pearls. I don't know. I thought it was pretty, so I bought it. It was a dollar or something or two dollars or whatever anyways um so yeah that is my alternative clothing haul some of it thrifted some of it new so hopefully the new stuff you guys can go find if you um if you like it and hopefully the thrifted stuff you could probably find something very similar to it please like and subscribe if you did like the video um i would love to have you here on my channel and join the toxic cupcake family um, and also share the video if you like it because uh, we can always use more members of the family. I will see you guys next time. Bye.